Hey, Sifu Boggy here. Sifu meaning guide, means somebody who helps you on your healing path. So, I have a saying. I have a Qigong for that. Meaning that if you have a bad back, an ailment, an injury, if you've got a sporting ability that you want to improve, I've got a Qigong pretty much for everything. So, my question is this. What do you need a Qigong for? Love, Qi and Shen. Boggy out. Hey Sifu, Emily Harrison here. I want to increase my intuition so I can get clearer messages from spirit and my guides. You got a Qigong for that? Emily Harrison, Sifu E. Of course. Don't bears do Kung Fu. They do. And here's one for you. Hi, Sifu Boggy here. So, a very simple exercise. You will actually find this one on YouTube. You go into YouTube and look up Willow Tree Qigong. Sifu Boggy, Willow Tree Qigong. Over 10,000 people have seen this one, but a very quick version of it. So, shoulder width stance, bend your knees, pull your bum in, and then from the belly button upwards, belly button to your nose, I want you to keep the hips facing straight ahead as you pull your bum in, face the hips straight ahead, turn the waist to the left, turn the waist to the right, turn the waist to the left, waist to the right, allow the arms to naturally flop, don't control them, just turn them from the left to the right, and this is simply called twist the waist, or willow tree chigong. So, and this does lots of things, but it massages the, the back, it helps neck, shoulders, uh, and head. So it's very good for migraines, it's very good for poor circulation in the hands, neck and shoulders. It massages the internal organs, so it's good for IBS stomach troubles. Uh, it's also uh, good for the lower back and spine. It's a very simple exercise, just twist the waist from the left to the right, and allow the arms to flop. And that's it for now, and hopefully we'll see you again soon with another Qigong. Love, Qi, and Shen. Sifu Boggy out. Sifu Boggy here, another one for increasing your psychic abilities, to improving your potential, opening up all possibilities, opening up your psychic energy, your consciousness, is quite simply, Breathing in, touching your belly, drawing the hands all the way up to the top of the head, and then breathing out and gently allowing the hands to drop in front of you. Back down to in between your legs and belly, then breathe in, draw the way up, breathe out, all the way down. Do this, you can do this seated, you can do it laying down on the bed, um, preferably not driving the car, it might be a bit dangerous, but, or, or you can do it jumping out of an aeroplane, I've had just done that. But so, it's just so in a whooshy position, or even a little bit of wider stance, feet 45 degrees outwards, uh, what's called a shouting wild horse stance. Breathe in, draw the hands all the way up to the top of the head, breathe out, gently drop them down. Breathe to the side, breathe in, all the way up to the side of the head, top of the head, breathe out, go down. It's a nice, simple exercise, and it allows the energy inside you to flow and to expand. So do that with also the pushing out to the forward and sides and you will increase your psychic abilities. But there's, there are many more. Come and see me on Patreon forward slash Seafood Boggy or the Chi Tribe School, the Shundao Chi Tribe School. Come and find me there. Um, until next time, love Chi and Shen. Here, probably in another top. So that was a Qigong 4. I got a Qigong for that. So hope you enjoyed that. If you have an ailment or injury, why not message me and ask me, but Sifu Boggy, do you have a Qigong 4? And tell me what it is. That's it for now. Why not come and join me on Discord on Sifu Boggy's Chi Tribe or even join the Shundao School of Qigong and energy work and come and learn Qigong for yourself. That's it for now. Love, Chi, and Shen. In the Sifu Boggy out.